Well guys, I'm not sure if you can see it or not, but it's kind of foggy out here. Um, we don't know if that's normal or not because we're not used to, well, I'm up this early, but I'm never outside this early. So, we're not sure if this is normal or not. So, but, good morning neighborhood community. We are leaving for the doctor's office right now. I'm not sure what's all going to take place today. But, oh, it's hard to get in this truck. But we will definitely keep you guys updated as soon as we know anything. Here's Kevin, wide awake and bushy-tailed. Wide-eyed and bushy-tailed. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> Bushy beard instead of tailed. Hey, I trimmed my beard. Well, I just can't show your tail because you're sitting on it. <laughs> Oops, I got to get my seatbelts on. Anyway, we will see you guys either at the doctor's or after. Bye. See, oh, bye. I told you you'd have your own room <laughs> named after you and everything. And they do a little flower for me. I'd, uh, I'd show Val right now, but she's getting naked. <laughs> don't don't fall. Please fell. don't fall. <laughs> hey, Mickey, you're so fun. You're so fun. You blow my mind. Hey, Mickey. Hey, Mickey. Meow. Yeah. That was your cue. Oh, are you camera shy, buddy? Meow. Yeah. We have Mickey kind of tied up to the door there because uh, Mickey's got to go to the vet and she's not allowed to, he's not allowed to have any food. And he just meow. Yeah. He's got a sensitive tummy and so he can't have anything that's not on his like strict, super bland and expensive diet. <laughs> so... He's tied up so that he doesn't get any of the other animals' food aren't and doesn't steal my food. Aren't you just so happy about him? <laughs> I don't regret him. I love him. Yes, but financially, aren't you just so happy about him? No. <laughs> Not even a little bit. <laughs> so Kayla came to sit with me for a little bit while Kevin went and did a job today. Yeah. So... I wasn't left alone being all sad and depressed and frustrated. <clears throat> so she doesn't have another standing on a swivel chair incident. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What do you think, Boomer? Huh? <laughs> no? No. Come on, buddy. I'm here. He's going, wow. He's sitting down on everything. I'll I'm just on. pretend that it's not a big deal. I'm on camera, so I gotta act cool. Yeah, that's the dog. You recognize him. Yeah, that gray thing by the door had a little different smell. <laughs> I didn't recognize the smell. <laughs> doctors but I was a little upset so I kind of just took a nap and relaxed for a little bit so Kayla came over uh, yeah Kayla came over and sat with me for a little bit while Kevin ran and did a job um, got a little upset at the doctors today um, basically Everything that the doctor told me yesterday, this doctor reversed. 
so um, we're back to square one. Um, nobody wants to do anything about any of the issues that I'm having. Um, I sat there and cried in his office and said, you know, if this is not what's wrong with me, there is obviously something wrong with me. And I went through this many, many years ago when I had my hysterectomy. I fought and fought and fought and fought with the doctors. They kept telling me there was nothing wrong with me. Finally, I convinced them to do an exploratory surgery and they found out I had endometriosis severe. And that's why I had to have a hysterectomy. And I'm not gonna back down from this. There is something wrong. I'm not going to spend the rest of my life on this couch in pain and popping pain pills. I'm not going to do it. So, what do you have to say, babe? They say I'm tired. <laughs> tired of going to the doctor. We got another one tomorrow. So. Yep, because this doctor basically told me to follow up with my primary care doctor. Yep. Which is what we did. Or we're going to do. Tomorrow morning. Yep. we got another doctor's appointment. So, regardless of whether or not it's a prolapse, I'm still having the same issues. They don't want to fix it. They did confirm that you have the th thinning of the walls due to lack of estrogen. Right. But he says you didn't have a prolapse and you're, you didn't have the other thing, which was hernia. Which I don't know why the other doctor said you did. If not. So, I don't know. I don't know either. Well, we've been through this before, too. Mm-hmm. Many times. <laughs> so. so. Anyway, we're going to go ahead and call it an evening. Um... We hope you enjoyed a little bit of something that you may have seen in the video today. If you did, please give us a favorite. Please give us a thumbs up. Please leave us a comment down below. Please share our video with your family and friends. But, most of all, Didn't mean to wake you ready? You, there, buddy. you ready? But, are you done? But, most of all, Please subscribe. <laughs> she's on strike. Hello. She's Hello. On, she's on strike. Hello. You awake? McFly. But. Woo. Go ahead. But. But. What the heck? You're fired. That's it. You're fired. You're fired. But, most of all, please subscribe, and we will see you all tomorrow. <laughs> Ta-ta for now. I love you. I love you. I love you. You got a sore throat? <laughs> Is that what you use your butt sore throat? Goodbye.